Welcome to the Hayworth X99 Adjustment Instructional Video. This video demonstrates all available features of the X99 chair line. Please keep in mind, your specific chair may not be equipped with every feature highlighted. Let's begin with the pneumatic height adjustment used in adjusting the seat to different heights located just below the right side of the seat cushion. To raise the height, pull the lever up while lifting your weight out of the chair. To lower the height, simply lift up the lever while seated. When adjusted correctly, feet should rest flat on the floor or foot rest without undue pressure on the underside of the thighs. The thigh to torso angle should be 90 degrees or more. Seat Depth Adjustment Realizing that users come in different sizes, this adjustment extends the seat depth, offering three separate positions. Seat depth is adjusted by pulling the front edge of the seat forward slightly and rotating it toward you. To decrease the seat depth, rotate the front edge of the seat away from you and then push the front edge of the seat toward you. Be sure that the body is supported by the backrest and the seat pan does not touch the back of the knees, allowing them to bend comfortably at 90 degrees or greater. Tilt tension adjustment found on the right side of the chair, this tuck away control mechanism adjusts the force necessary to recline in the chair. To adjust, simply pull the lever out and rotate forward or clockwise to increase the force. Rotate backwards or counterclockwise to decrease the force. You should be able to sit upright as well as recline when the tension is adjusted correctly. Back stop adjustment found on the left side of the chair. This control locks the back in an upright position. To engage the back lock, simply sit upright in the chair and pull up on the lever. To disengage the back lock, push down on the lever and recline. Lumbar height adjustment raises or lowers the lumbar support height to best support the lower back. For Meshback X99 chairs, reach behind and raise or lower the lumbar support to adjust the lumbar height. For upholstered back X99 chairs, raise or lower the grips on the chair. Adjust the lumbar support so that the curvature of the chair's lumbar coincides with the lumbar curve or small of the back. Lumbar depth adjustment allows for the adjustment of the depth of the lumbar support. For meshback X99 chairs, reach behind and rotate the knob clockwise to increase the lumbar depth. To decrease the depth, rotate counterclockwise. For upholstered back X99 chairs, increase lumbar depth by pumping the lower right lever for added support. To decrease the depth, simply push this lever down to release. Arm height adjustment. To adjust arm height, press the lever at the base of the arm and raise or lower the arm. Arm height should be adjusted so that it supports forearms or elbows in a manner that avoids lifting the shoulders or having to lean to the side to reach the armrest. Arm depth adjustment. To adjust the arm cap depth, firmly grasp the arm cap and slide front to back. This adjustment allows you to get closer to your work surface while maintaining effective use of the armrest and back support. Armrest Pivot. To provide forearm support while performing a variety of tasks, the armrest will rotate in or out with a simple turn of the arm cap. Passive Forward Tilt. X99 is equipped with a passive forward tilt system. To engage this feature, simply lean forward while seated in the chair. These adjustments have been designed to enhance your comfort productivity, and overall well-being. Your Hayworth X99 chair can be readjusted as these factors dictate throughout your workday.